Russian President Vladimir Putin has shown his strength with the largest naval exercises in the Pacific since the end of the Cold War, ahead of a meeting with the US President next week. At least 20 ships, submarines and support vessels, also involves 20 fighter jets, took part in the large-scale war games. Biden last week warned that there would be robust and meaningful consequences for Russia's harmful activities as he kicked off his first international tour as president with the G7 summit. Putin and Biden will meet in Geneva on Wednesday for a summit. It is their first face-to-face -face meeting since Biden became president. U.S. President Joe Biden warned Russian President Vladimir Putin that harmful activities would be met with robust and meaningful consequences. Footage of the massive exercise shows the Russians locating and expelling a fake enemy submarine. During the exercise, the crews of the Pacific Fleet's warships fired from the AK-630 automatic naval gun and the A-190 Universal Naval Artillery, a statement from the Moscow Defense Ministry said. The search and tracking of the fake enemy's submarines was carried out by the large anti-submarine ship Admiral Pantaleev equipped with guided missile weapons, the frigate Marshal Shaposhnikov and three corvettes, Sputnik said. Former Chief of the General Staff of the Russian Navy, Admiral Viktor Kravchenko, said, in the post-Soviet period, there have been no comparable exercises involving such a large number of armed forces. Rear Admiral Konstantin Kabantsov called the exercises unique because of the large area of the Pacific Ocean where they take place, adding that no such exercises have been conducted in the recent history of the Russian fleet. Thank you for watching, and if you like this video don't forget to like and subscribe my channel for more updates.